FD1 Formula Drone 1 is a multi-copter hybrid electric vertical takeoff and landing aircraft with the shape of its duct fans and a triangle formation. The concept Evitol was inspired by a 1950s Formula 1 Ferrari racing car. The designers wanted to take the curves and design elements of the iconic racing car to use as a base and create the modern but retro looking aircraft design. The FD1 has six electric engines connected to a V12 gasoline engine located in the front part of the vehicle and has three battery packs. The vehicle can fly by receiving the necessary power directly from the engine or the battery. The aircraft even has a retro style exhaust pipes tapering at a backward angle. The fuselage is carbon fiber which keeps the weight down to a minimum and provides high strength. The aircraft can comfortably hold two passengers in a fun open cockpit. There aren't many details as of yet, but we do know that the hybrid vehicle has an estimated top speed of 500 km an hour and an estimated flight time of over 3 hours. The designers are still seeking for investors help start the construction prototypes for this futuristic aircraft. Aluda Mark III The world's first fully functioning electric frying race car has come to life with the Aluda designed Airspeeder Mark III. This full-sized and remotely operated electric vehicle will race in remotely piloted airspeeder competitions. While the racing series is soon to be announced, the remotely piloted races will introduce close-quarter flying circuit racing at speeds of more than 120 km an hour. The future vehicle includes LiDAR and radar collision avoidance systems create a virtual force field around the aircraft to ensure close but ultimately safe racing. The Mark III features a carbon fiber frame and fuselage chosen for its strength, stiffness and lightweight properties, which ensure maneuverability, performance and efficiency. Tetra Aviation Mark 5 Mark 5 is a lightweight, single-seat, lift and crew style aircraft running 32 vertical lift rotors distributed across long thin wings at the front and rear of a small cabin with a single pusher prop on the rear for cruise flight. Its frame is mainly aluminum and the bodywork is a lightweight carbon fiber reinforced polymer with some armored fibers in there too. As for power, the Mark V packs a 13.5 kilowatt hour battery for clean cruising. The Japanese startup says that it gives the plane a top speed of 100 miles per hour and a range of 100 miles. That'll get you from New York City to Hamptons in no time at all. The cockpit accommodates just one person who helms the aircraft via joystick and semi-automatic fly-by-wire electric control. Tetra Aviation plans to start delivering the Mach 5 as a kit plane as early as 2022. Air Car V5 A flying car is something we've been promised since the world of tomorrow days of the 1950s. Although there have been contenders over the years, nothing that truly fills the dual role of both an automobile and an airplane being developed. But that might be about a change. The Kleinvision Air Car V5 has made its maiden flight and 
is expected to clear the European Union's ASA certification process within six months. The air car converts from auto to airplane in three minutes, requires just a thousand feet of runway and is powered by a 300 horsepower BMW engine. The range is over 600 miles and the air car carries two passengers with up to 450 pounds of cargo. Most importantly, the car has been designed to be as aerodynamically stable as possible, making it accessible to pilots at all skill levels. Joby S4 The Joby is powered by six vertical motors, both for vertical takeoff and landing, and for cruising, and can easily seat up to five people, including the pilot. It can travel at a top speed of 200 miles per hour with a range of 150 miles, which is equivalent to a trip between Seattle and Vancouver or LA. To San Diego, the company which is backed by Toyota and recently acquired Uber's flying taxi division has said that it plans to have a full-scale air taxi service in operation by 2024, including regional trips. Archer Marker The marker is a full-scale two-passenger demonstrator aircraft. The gleaming silver vehicle looks like an airplane slash helicopter hybrid, with two wings sporting six rotors each jutting out from an egg-shaped fuselage. It will have a range of 60 miles thanks to a 75 kilowatt hour battery and a top speed of 150 miles per hour. The entire wingspan is 40 feet and, according to the folks at Archer Aviation, when cruising 2,000 feet in the air, the aircraft will be 100 times quieter than any helicopter, generating only 45 decibels of sound. The vehicle is electric powered and can easily carry up to two passengers for short flights within the city or region. Using tilt rotors, Marker is designed to take off and land vertically like a helicopter then transition into forward flight just like plane. If you're enjoying the video so far, we would highly appreciate if you could smash that like button and subscribe with bell notifications to never miss a video from TechWow. Do it. Pal V Liberty. On the road, the vehicle looks like a small sports car, albeit one that can transform into a flying machine in a matter of moments. Already approved for Europe, it is available for pre order on the manufacturer's website. Developed in the Netherlands, the Pal V Liberty was created in collaboration with Italian design studios and, according to its makers, it takes no more than two minutes to transform this vehicle into an aircraft. The vehicle provides unprecedented flexibility since it can theoretically take off from any runway. On the road, it can travel up to 160 kilometers an hour and has a range of over 1,300 kilometers. In the air, its cruising speed can also reach up to 160 kilometers, with flight times reaching an estimated 4 to 5 hours. The Pal V Liberty runs on an unleaded automated fuel, but no worries, since an electric version is currently being studied.